Hey, Trevor Matthews here. I had a request to talk about the Advanced Scroll Temperature Protector. If you don't know, Copla makes over 25 different scrolls and they all work differently. Different applications, different capacities, different refrigerants, and different internals. And this is one that I've seen compressors come back here to our Copeland lab to be inspected and there is nothing wrong with it because this internal protector was protecting the compressor. What advanced scroll temperature protection does, it protects the scroll from overheating, any cause of overheating. And how it works is there's a bimetal disc designed underneath the floating seal. So the floating seal balances out the fixed scroll or the stationary scroll. And underneath there, is this little bimetal disc. So as that temperature starts to rise and it gets over a certain temperature, 275, between 275 and 300, depending on the model, it'll, it'll open up and it will bypass discharge gas or it'll bypass gas into the suction. The compressor will still run, but it will not pump. So when you go come up and put your gauges on it, it will, the, the pressure is uh, gonna be equalized and it's still gonna generate heat. You can take your amp clamp at that time too, put the amp clamp on and you're gonna have a lower amp uh, rating because you're not doing any work. You're not pumping any gas. And if this continues to happen and the problem's not fixed, you're gonna ge just generate more heat in that compressor until it trips off on its internal protectors. Then what happens, that bimetal disc will reset before, usually before the motor protector and you will have to allow it to cool. It could be a half an hour, it could be an hour, it could be two hours, it could be three hours, depending on how hot that stator and that rotor get. So it's very important to take a look and understand the different compressors you're working on. Because it's not this device is not in all scrolls. It's in some ZP, some ZR, some ZBs, lots of different ones. But what they all have is this little information right here it says copeland scrolls advanced scroll temperature protector compressor may stop pumping with motor running turn off and wait until cool may need more than one hour to reset so that is very important to understand because if you don't allow the time and you you put your gauges on and it's running you could think it's a failed compressor but really it's the protector inside protecting it i'm going to throw a video in the description i'm also going to throw a presentation if you want to take a look at it my name is Trevor Matthews. Let's get a conversation going.